Welcome back everyone, another episode of Rick's Gadgets here. I decided to pick me up one of these uh, 18650 LED uh, flashlights, one of the bigger, higher illumination ones. Uh, just since I've been doing my DIY power wall and I've got a bunch of extra cells laying around, I thought that uh, I would get uh, one of these flashlights and just see how they perform. And uh, overall, it, it is a lot brighter than the, the cheap dollar, two dollar ones that you get. Uh, that run off of like uh, AA batteries <clears throat> but uh, so far um, I mean like I said the the brightness is really bright um, it does get really hot um, but uh, I kind of wanted to show you around the flashlight and see what you get uh, I'm not going to do a true unboxing but uh, you know just kind of show some things that are in the box and what you need to look out for and does it truly live up to the hundred thousand hours uh, so let me show you what's in the box so there's not a lot in the box really so um, first I want to start off with this USB charging cable um, it does charge via a micro USB one thing that I noticed was the plug-in is very long on this and I was worried on the flashlight you know does it require that long of one um, and I have used just standard uh, USB cables so you know if you don't have this one handy you're in your car or something you got one for your phone it's a micro USB it will work so uh, that's one thing you don't have to worry about too much on the, the using this specific cable you can use any micro USB cable uh, another nice thing it came with it comes with another o-ring because uh, it is watertight and it has a lanyard that you can strap on it and use it um, you know so you don't drop it now overall you can see it's got quite a few LEDs in there um, it's got one button and one um, little indicator here that gives you the battery remaining as well as the level when you turn it on um, nine is the highest it'll go so when you have fully charged batteries it will show a nine um, but it has three levels everything's controlled via this button there's the medium and then there's low and then off high um so on the batteries um I have used this, uh, I charged it up fully, uh, I used it about 15 minutes the other day, it's still showing 9. I am going to do some more testing on it, um, maybe before I post this video, the remainder of the video, um, but the batteries that come with it, I don't think it's going to live up to the, the full 100,000 hours, and let me show you why here. I'm going to open it up. So the top just unscrews. And what you got is your four 18650 cells. And they just kind of drop in there. Um, and if you can see, these show 3.7 volts at 4,000 milliamps. Um, I do see a lot of these cells uh, since I've been processing them, especially coming from China, that really over-exaggerate how many amp hours. So what I did was, I actually put it in my charger and tested it and I only came up with 2000 milliamps so that one's about half of what they're advertising and this one it was about the same 2030 so wouldn't believe how much the they, they put into the the actual numbers on these cells because they really, like I said, over exaggerate them. So only expect about a 2000 milliamp um, life out of those. So I don't think it's going to live up to that. But for emergency use, um, I think you'll get, uh, you know, several hours out of it and good bright light. But now I want to show you just a nighttime shot in my backyard. Uh, it won't be a video. I'm just going to take a still picture. And the first one, what I'll do is I'll show you here uh, this is a high intensity and it's shining at a fence I would say uh, probably 40 feet away 
and these trees here going up the tree you know those trees are at least 60 feet tall and now here it is on the medium intensity shining at the back again and here is the low so that's how the output so overall this flashlight I mean it's gonna serve its purpose I'm just got it for emergency use and like I said just to play with um, I could not even pronounce pronounce the name I think it would be Wago or something uh, type light um, there are some this one was $45 uh, on Amazon uh, there are more expensive ones uh, and there are some cheaper ones uh, I kind of went with this one it's kind of in the range middle range and uh, and again I think it's going to do what I need it to do so anyway hope you like this quick video and uh, don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button and don't forget to stop by and check out some future videos thanks have a great day